baseball fans, and welcome. MLB The Show brings you Diamond Dynasty Baseball. It's the Arizona Diamondbacks taking on the Thunder. First pitch coming your way next. This is Corbin Carroll. Leading off for Arizona, the right fielder, number seven. Corbin and the pitch Carroll. swing and a high fly ball down the left field line but hooking foul and a pitch that oh. one's in there and that is strike two oh. swings and misses struck him out now up next for Arizona Jake McCarthy that's in there that's strike one Swing and a high fly ball. Pretty well struck right field. That one's back. And gone! He'll touch them all. And just like that, they're out front. It's 1-0. Could tell Marte up to the plate. That's oh, yeah. a strike. Part of the order coming through now. And with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking Good to run. do some more damage. Swing and a oh, miss. He was late. Strike two. He's a bad ball hitter, so even if you get him to chase pitches outside the zone, he still might beat you. Not an easy out by any means. And now it's Christian Walker. And yeah. he takes a strike. Next oh. pitch is downstairs. And a swing and a miss. And that'll do it. Bottom of the first. We'll say Altuve up to it here. The second baseman. The pitch. Altuve. That's towards center. That gets down for a hit. So a man on base to start the inning. Here's Francisco Lindor. Francisco. Swing and a miss, and he was fooled. Oh, wow. Gallen cites the fact that as a kid he had small hands, and that allowed him to develop his changeup. Still a really good pitch for him now as a major leaguer. Swing yeah. and a miss as he was late that time. Gosh, a little late on that breaking ball. I don't think he recognized it out of the hand. Just a little tardy. That's a hit. Lead runner makes the turn at second. And now runners at the corners. Nobody out. Back-to-back -back singles. Just a solid swing That's right good. there. Caught it out front. And it into the outfield for the base hit. Those always feel great. At the play. Walker. Fired to second. And a run scores on the double play. Here's Trout. We talk about guys with good speed, and definitely he has it. But pushing the offense aside for just a second, Chris, it's the defensive side that I think the speed factors in the most. The 1 0. Swings through that one for strike one. But he gets to balls that get by most people at that position. Just really impressive because there are certain ball, times the ball strike. comes off the bat, automatically that team that hit it thinks that they've got a base hit or they may have extra bases, and he just takes it away. Tied up here in the early going. He swings and hits a fly ball, center field. Makes the grab on the run. And we're back. Second inning set to go. Now the left fielder, yeah. Lourdes Goriel Jr. And that's a fair ball. Nice line drive to the pole side right there, but he didn't spin off of it. That's the key. You still have to extend through the baseball in order to hit a line drive like that. Fouled off. He was late. Nobody out. Runner at first. That one ripped right center field. That's going back. Back some more. And it's gone. And they add a pair. It's 3-1. Eugenio Suarez up to the plate now. Foul ball. 
can be tough to bounce back after a big home run, but nobody on, nobody out. You just have to treat it as a fresh inning. Ramirez settles under it. One away. Next to hit for Arizona, Geraldo Perdomo. That yeah. one finds the zone, and it's 0-1. One one. One. Perdomo getting to start at shortstop, 24 years old, and he was born in the Dominican Republic. Goes down looking. And now the catcher comes up to him. Gabriel Moreno. Nope. Up and in. Ball one. On the ground to the left. The throw to first. And that is that. Bottom half of inning number two. Here is Ozzie Albies up to him. Albies. The pitch. Left field. Guriel has it sized up. Makes the catch for the out. So up next, Adam Dunn. Obviously a guy who makes good contact, hits for average. But one of the things in today's game, the value in the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Marte throws the first in time. That's out number two. Here's Jose Ramirez. He's always a threat at the plate. He's been flexing his power in the majors for a long time now. His first career home run was to right field. Right here inside. Oh, diving stop. Nicely done for the out. Out of the third inning. Here's the Diamondbacks leadoff hitter, Corbin Carroll. The pitch. It's been a rough start that on the mound for this guy. His third inning is so important for him to get wow. on track, turn the page, settle in, do all those things you need to do to give your team a little bit of length in this one. And a quick out number one. The center fielder, Jake McCarthy. And a foul ball. Next offering is in for a strike. No ball. One out, base is empty. Lifted in the air, out to left. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there's two down. Marte stands in now and watches oh, strike and one. one. He swings and fouls one off. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. Got and a nice inning of work. Back in Washington, D.C. Now it's the right fielder, the right Lawrence fielder. Butler. Lawrence. And that one is lifted in the air. McCarthy makes the grab one down. And now it's Kieber Ruiz. Foul ball there. The D-backs up by two here in the last half of the third. That That's misses the, the zone, and the count is one and two. And a base hit up the middle. So now back to the top of the order. He was all over that one. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center ball. field. Now Tuve at the plate for the second time as he takes ball one. And oh. another ball. Last two pitches have been down Coming in the up. zone. Pitcher clearly trying to get that ground ball double play. But in this count, you're going to have to give in, elevate his pitches, and get back into this at bat. There's a swing and a drive. That one's carrying. And he goes airborne to make the catch. Now batting. Third now up to hit Francisco Lindor. One for one with a single so far. Swing and a foul back. That's out of play. Two outs. Yeah. Big swing and a miss. I think he was sitting off speed there. Chu now. Oh. In the dirt. No advance. Good job behind the dish. Oh. 
battling here as he fouls it away. Another one, two. Wouldn't two chase two. that time. Well, this is a guy that can be frustrating for pitchers because he fouls off so many pitches and grinds out the at-bat. I'm sure there's some times where a pitcher would rather just give up a first-pitch single than have to waste six or seven pitches on one hitter. Kicks and fires. In the air, right field. And that's the third out. Set for the start of the inning. And here's the first baseman, Christian Walker. Do the swing to miss. 0 oh 1. Strike two. 0 oh 2. Swing and a ball popped up. Altuve should have this one. Makes the grab one away. Here's Guriel. Riel gets a piece. Comes up empty. That's strike two. Oh and two. Swing and a miss. And he struck him out. Two up, two down. Two out, space is empty. And next is the Diamondbacks DH. Jack Peterson. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, yeah. it'll be a very positive sign for no him ball. and for his two team. Three. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Ready to go, bottom four. Now it's the DH, Chipper Jones. Fought off foul. Swings through that. Good pitch right there, tied him up on the hands. If I'm out there on the bump, I'm going right back in there. Wouldn't chase no, that time. Up. And that's oh, a little that's bit high. high. And the count is even two and two. Well, he's not afraid to fall into a two strike count. Knows the strike zone very well. So much so that I think umpires will look at him and determine whether it's a ball or strike if he swings or not. Out to short. Perdomo gets it to first. Already two gone here in the home the four. Number one. Ozzie Albee's up to the plate. Ozzie. Albee. Swings yeah. through that one. 0 oh and 1. No Over 80% of his first pitches are strikes. When you're doing that, you could have a really good day out there on the mound. Bunting, but that's a foul ball. Right hander kicks deals. Foul ball. It stays nothing in two. The Diamondbacks leading by two. We're here in the bottom of the fourth. Out to center. McCarthy sizing this one up. Drops into the glove. And that ends the end. And welcome back to the ballpark. A Eugenio Suarez up to hit down. And that is in for a strike. Oh, it's 0 1. Suarez in his 10th season, 32 years old, and he was that's born in Venezuela. 1 2. And that's that skips in the dirt. Swing and a miss, and he got him. And one gone. And now the shortstop, Geraldo Perdomo. Right through there for a strike. There's a strike. Got it by him for the K. Two outs, space is empty. Here's the catcher, Gabriel Moreno. Out to short. Oh, nice play. Gathers and throws. And that's a nice play to end the inning. Back here in Nationals Park. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's some real power at the plate. Adam Dunn. On the ground. Perdomo. Tosses to first. And the leadoff hitter retired in the fifth. Here's Jose Ramirez. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Lets the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Perdomo oh. on to first. And Ramirez is set down. And now it's going to be Lawrence Butler. Check hey, swing. Did he go? Yes, he did. Balls, one strike. Two down, nobody on. Last half of inning number five. Now That's one and one. On the ground, right side. 
Tosses to first. Three up, three down. All right, we go to the top half of inning number six. And now, Corbin Carroll. Not in time. He's safe. Now back. Jake McCarthy stands in now for the Diamondbacks. And yeah, there's a breaking ball that drops in there. Swings through that one for strike two. No ball. Two strikes. Stays alive. The healthy cut. Tough pitch at 98. But a really good pass at the ball. Called strike three and a fastball up in the zone. Here's Cattell Marte. Runner on the go. Lifted in the air right center field. Butler flashes the leather on the running catch. Next up for the Diamondbacks, Christian Walker. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. 0-1. Oh one. That one to first. He takes it Get himself up. to the bag, and that'll do it. And we're back, bottom of the six. And now, Hebert Ruiz. And a foul ball. Well, these guys, as you probably noticed, haven't been shy at the plate at all. In fact, they've probably been too aggressive at oh. times. It feels like it's been one first pitch out after another, and they've given up eight outs on the first pitch alone. That one hit to right. Carroll moving under it, and it's caught for the out. So the lineup flips over. Here's the former MVP, Jose no, Altuve. The second baseman, Jose. Oh, and a swing and a miss there. No ball, one strike. Swing and a miss as he was out front. 0 oh 2. That misses, ball. and it's 1 and 2. Turn the right guy at the right spot. They really need a rally, and this guy is someone you can believe in to find a way to get on base. Hook. Swings through it for the K. Chase the fastball up the ladder for strike three. Francisco Lindor comes up to the plate. And first offering is fouled off. Puts it in the air out towards left center. Snags it on the run. And back in Washington, D.C. New inning getting started. Now at the plate, Lourdes Goriel Jr. And a pitch. And a big swing and a miss. Oh, and two. Swings Here's through that, it. and it's a strikeout. And there's one away. And Jack Peterson stands in. There's a strike. Base is empty one away here in the top half of inning number seven. He's controlling things out there on the mound, not messing around at all. He's been in attack mode since the very start. Swing and a miss struck him out. That's hard hit in the line. And that is that. Bottom of the inning, and now the DH, Chipper Jones. Gallon back to work. Fouled off left side. I'm impressed by the number of first pitch strikes. He's not afraid of contact. Some guys go nibble just because they don't want to get hit hard. Oh. That's not what we're seeing here. Lifted in the air down the left side. Guriel handles the chance. And there's one down. Here's Mike Trout. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Bounce to third. Suarez throw to first in time. That's out number two. Now it's going to be Ozzy Albies. And he grounds one to the right side. And that chance handled. On to first. And Albies is... And welcome back to the ballpark. The, the batter down. Geraldo Perdomo. Perdomo. On a line. Base hit. Man aboard on the leadoff single. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. That pretty much split the zone down the middle. And those are the ones where you got to make them pay. That one fouled off. Righty to the plate. Strike two. No ball. Two strikes. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. 
So the batting order turns over. Now up next for Arizona, Corbin oh. Carroll. First pitch doesn't find the zone. And yeah, there's the strike. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Got him swinging. And at first, next yeah, to hit for Arizona, Jake McCarthy. And a foul ball. Bounce to the right. Throws to first. That's out number three. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Kevin Ginkle. He has a great slider with tons of movement. The first baseman, Adam. The pitch. Done. The batter now as he swings and misses for strike one. Oh, Winchin has been pretty dominant in this one, but you got to be careful. Not working with too big a lead. They could get right back in this ball game one if one. you're not careful. Ball one there. Yeah. Late on that fastball. One and two to count. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One away. Now it's Jose Ramirez. Swing and a pop-up under it. Makes the grab for the second out. And now the right fielder, Lawrence Butler. And the first no, pitch misses done. for ball one. Boog, he never moved because he never had time to. With that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher yeah, to walk away. Got it started a little one too early. One. Strike one. Two down, nobody on. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Looking very settled on the mound here in the eighth. One more out. They'll probably hand it off to their closer for the ninth with at least a two-run lead. Next one misses. Now two and two. And down on strikes. We go to the ninth. Here's the second baseman. Cattell Marte on the ground right side. Throw over to Dunn. And they get the leadoff man in the ninth. Walker yeah. batting with one down takes a strike. Oh, one. That one, one ball, miss. one strike. What makes him special is a lot of pitchers lose movement in their stuff no, the ball. deeper they go into a game. But he's just different. We see plenty of break in his pitches, even when he's running a little low in the tank. Pitch count misses, full. and the count's full. Bases empty, one away. Here at the top of the ninth. Headed towards the corner, sizes this one up, brings it in, out number two. Here's Lourdes Gurriel Jr. This one smacked out to left center. Makes the grab, and that's the inning. Back now, and on the mound, the closer, Paul Seawall. I think closer has to be one of the toughest jobs in baseball, and we see a pretty high turnover rate because of it. Every outing seems to be high pressure, this one included. We'll see if he can wrap up the win and get himself a save. In the air, right side. Carroll moves towards it. He's got it, and there's one down. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. Jose Altuve getting ready to hit. Next offering, pop foul off to the right out of play. Center field. McCarthy snags it for the second out. So they're down to their final out. And now it's switch hitting third baseman Francisco Lindor. One for three. And that's ball. downstairs and outside. One ball, no strike. Two run game with two away here in the bottom of the ninth. Now a fly ball to right center. McCarthy settles under it. 
He's got it. Ball game. And the Diamondbacks claim the win here behind some great pitching and defense. Great pitchers duel in this one. You get to a certain point where each pitcher is trying to outdo the other, go a little bit deeper into the ball game. And for these pitchers, it really came down to a few key at bats. This was a fun one to watch.